What's up, world? It's your friend. Work hard, work out harder. And today, we're going to do our first home workout. Today's home workout is working on four major muscles. The quadricep, the hamstring, the chest, the back, and of course, the abdominals. Today's workout can be done three different ways. Sets and reps, you choose a number of sets, let's say three sets, and you do eight to 12 reps of each exercise in a superset form. Then at the end, you rest between 30 seconds to a minute and repeat. Time base, time base, you put 10 minutes to 30 minutes on the clock, and then you do each exercise until the time runs out. You rest as needed. Station-based. Station-based means you add time on the clock with rest in between each exercise. So let's say 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. Or 30 seconds of work, 30 seconds of rest. And you move between each exercise as if it was a station. And you pick a number of rounds. Three to five rounds. Understood? The first exercise is a single kettlebell straight leg deadlift. Important aspect of this exercise, make sure you hip hinge. If you don't know what that is, please use Bishop Google. The next exercise is a chin up. not do the chin up, you can do a standing band pull as demonstrated. Remember, the thinner the band, the easier the resistance. The thicker the band, the more difficult. Third exercise, dumbbell squat. Both dumbbells need to be above the shoulders in a neutral position. And you squat down to the height of a chair, keeping your knees parallel or behind your toe. If you're unable to do this exercise with weight, you can use or do body weight squats. Fourth exercise is a push-up. During the push-up, make sure your elbows are at an angle towards your feet, halfway between your shoulders and your body. If you are unable to do a push-up, you can do a modified push-up. Make sure that your knees and your body still make a straight line and that your chest will be the first thing to hit the floor and not your face. The last exercise is the ab wheel rollout. If you're not strong enough to roll back or roll all the way out, go to your limit and then bring the roller back. In time, you will increase your core strength and be able to do this exercise with full range of motion. Stay fit, healthy, and positive.